Hi everyone, hope you're all well. And here we are, ready for the first anniversary draw. So, uh, there has been a late entrant, and Lee Wall has nominated Viaduct Central. So, it's been, yeah, I think successful. Uh, there's, let's look in, 26 entrants, and some new channels that I um, have uh, not seen before. So, yeah, quite exciting. So it seems to have worked, and, and, and the feedback I got is that uh, people thought it was a good idea. And I must say, um, I did nick uh, the idea off of Tim at Family Model Railway. So thanks, Tim. Um, but yeah, if we can just get a little boost up for um, the smaller channels, that that would be great. There's some crackers out there. Um, another one I've come across is Martin at Traitor's Gate. Um, that's terrific. It's got a nice little phallus system in as well. So um, yeah, that that's um, yeah that's another good channel. But without further ado, what I'm going to do um, is put all the names into a random name drawer computer system. Press a button, sees who comes out. So there's a first prize, and there's two very small consolation prizes. So uh, without further ado. Hi everyone, and here we are for the draw. Now, this is not of the greatest of uh, technical feats. Here I am holding a camera pointing at my laptop, which has got a number of um, names, well, all the names, in a random name generator. Now, if I can just come in a little bit closer and you can see the names, and now I'm going to attempt to just run down the list again just as you can see I have crossed all the names off and everybody who has entered should be in there so here we are so this is for the main prize here is the the draw spinner let's just focus just for the uh, to bring the, the tension up a little bit right are we focused I think we are I'm pressing the generator now and the winner is Mini Wist Aston that's Rachel Rachel at Mini Wist Aston brilliant so I'm just going to log that down. Mini Wistaston wins the... Oh, I got so excited that the camera went shaky. So that wins um, £25 from me, £10 from Jeff at Jumble Lane Printing. So there we are everybody. And now I'm just going to remove Rachel. And if for any reason Rachel didn't want the prize, um, there's going to be some reserves. And there will be a little prize for them. Now I do apologise for the uh, camera shake there. Come on focus you little devil. Here we go, this is for the second... Dragon Junction, so Alan at Dragon Junction, there is a very small consolation prize coming up to you. Let's remove Alan. Come on, focus you little devil. Here we go for the third prize. which is Portobello Junction. So there we are, folks. That is the three winners. Rachel at Mini West Aston, Alan at Dragon Junction, and uh, Portobello Junction. So, um, yeah, well done, everyone.
Okay then, folks, that was a draw. Um, apologies for the rather dodgy camera work, but um, I was trying to hold the camera whilst pressing the buttons. But uh, there we go. Um, so we've got a winner. It's Rachel at Mini Wistaston. She wins in total, it'll be £35 worth of boots at Jeff at Jumble Lane. Um, even if you weren't a winner, I'd suggest, you know, go and have a look at um, Jeff on his Facebook and um, uh, page and see what he's got on offer um, on his shop. There's some really good stuff there. Um, Allen at Dragon Junction and Portobello Junction um, just got the second and third prizes. So there is a little consolation for you. So Rachel, if you contact Jeff at Jumble Lane, and um, if um, Alan and Portobello want to uh, send me a message on um, my Facebook page, it's Kevin Carter, uh, with their addresses, if you don't mind, um, I'll um, send uh, it out in the post to you. Um, or, or you can uh, email me at um, the email address that's attached um, to uh, my details. So there we are. Thanks again for everybody who contributed it. Um, as I say, it was just a little something. And um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. Um, moving onwards uh, very quickly, just to let you know what's happening on the layout. Um, with the um, heat, um, it was difficult to, to do too much work in there. And now that the uh, temperature has dropped, um, it was just doing some remedial work of where the heat had lifted up some uh, of, of the um, paving I put down. Lucky enough the track hadn't buckled and that was probably due to my poor laying of flexi track where on the curves I ended up with a mill or so gap um, and that has worked a little bit in my favour. So there's not too much there but I have been doing a lot of research and I will be updating a video. Um, I hope you'll find it interesting um, just on what's going to happen for Midway uh, peninsula, where it's situated, what type of things are going to be running, um, and and just give you an idea of, of, of the layout of the area, and hopefully it makes a little bit of sense. There will be um, some running shots. At the moment, they're just ones where I've um, recorded them onto the iPhone and uh, just uploaded onto Facebook, because the layout um, is still um, lots of work in progress, so it's a little bit messy. Um, but once we are a bit more advanced, then there'll be some better shots, I hope. So uh, I hope you uh, stick with us, and um, as I say, that will be updated quite shortly. So all the best to everybody. Thanks very much um, for your participation, and um, keep well, and uh, happy modelling. <laughs>